Tov, a good week to you all. This week we study the portion of Achari. The majority of the portion deals with the special service, the special avoda that was done in the Beis Hamikdash, in the Holy Temple, on the holiest day of the year, Yom Kippur. It, it was on that day that the high priest would enter in to the Kodesh Hakadoshim, the Holy of Holies, to do the special avoda in the Kodesh Hakadoshim. And the portion begins by telling us that Moshe is to talk to Aaron, his brother, Achrei Moshe B'nei Aaron, after the death of the two children of Aaron. And the commentaries point out what was so special about the death of the two children of Aaron. Nodav and Avihu had this special desire to become close to the supernal light of God. And it was this strong desire that brought them close to the light that caused them to expire. The concept, the idea of death by a divine kiss. The difference when a person, a righteous person, dies by a divine kiss is that God kisses that individual. In this case, it was the other way around. Nada and Avil decided that they want to kiss God. They want to become close to God, even though it meant giving up their life. And that was something which was inappropriate. It was wrong for them. For we are instructed to serve God, body and soul, on this world. And although many times we have this strong desire to become close to God, or perhaps sometimes we are shown a special light from above, a special close feeling and inspiration, and we have this desire to come close to God, we have to see to, to utilize those moments of inspiration, whether it comes from us or from God, in our day-to-day -day life, to bring that inspiration of closeness to God, to serve God in our daily life, to live a life in this physical world and for the purpose of serving our Creator, to make every day of our life a holy day, to make every day of our life a special day, and to make every day of our life a day that will bring the world to a higher level of holiness. May God bless us to be successful in our mission, to bring godliness into this world, and to make this world a dira betachtonim, a dwelling place for the Almighty God. Have a wonderful week. Shua Tov.